This is a Pinball News production. This is where our tour begins. Uh, this is the cabling department. And this is where all the ladies here run our cables for the, for the games. The back boxes, the play fields, the cabinets, everything. And it's, it's quite an ordeal. It's very uh, labor intensive and there's a good amount of skill involved in pulling the tension on these wires. But with practice, everything gets better. <laughs> Yeah, d dinner time was the, the, the name for uh, um, Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Jeez, I'm, 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 I'm stuttering here. Yeah, dinner time was the code name for Walking Dead. So everybody figured they were going to have their dinner, you know. <laughs> eating, eating. <laughs> yeah, let's sneak through this way. These are some of the older cables and when uh, they need to run stuff for uh, Mustang. We have a biscuit, as in Sea Biscuit, the horse. Yeah. The, which was the code name for the uh, <laughs> for Mustang. There's some logic in there. Yeah, somewhere. I don't. I haven't figured out exactly where, but it's it's there. And this is, of course, is the uh, uh, cable termination area. You gotta put uh, plugs on all the all the little wires that need plugs. <laughs> and as long as I've been involved with it, it's always the girls sitting here doing this, and their hands are always taped up or gloved up. Because it's it really is uh, it's tough on your hands. In the old days, they had a tape they would actually just wrap around their fingers and then throw it out at the end of the day. Yeah, well, now we got rubber tips. <laughs> but they get callous, their their fingers will get cut. Uh, let's see what we got here. Pardon me. Am I going too fast? No? Okay. Good. Off to the side here, this is a, a sub-assembly area where all the uh, jet bumpers or drop targets or whatever needs to be put together gets us pre-assembled. And seeing as there's usually slingshots and things like that on every game, this this is always staffed. And there's always a bank of them lying around. But all the unique stuff comes through here too. There'll be uh, different things like the turntable on Mustang. You know that that went through here, and it's just like they'll put it together, and then it'll be something else for the next game. And here we have the beginning of. Uh, the playfield line, they come through here, but so we can get through this if you're very careful. <laughs> the playfields begin their lives here. Actually, they begin their lives in there. They come in blank from the cabinet company and get placed in here with the registration pins and I get compressed. And there's uh, two plates in there, one with the pins from the bottom, one with pins from the top. And it puts in all the spotting locations for all the screws that attach the lamps, the, the, the assemblies, and whatever. These also change with every game, of course. This 
piece of machinery has a history that goes back to the old Gottlieb days. I remember seeing them when I started over there back in North Lake. And it's been around. I think it went to Williams and now it's come over here to Stern. Good. <laughs> Cabinets starting back here. You clean them up. Touch up the slight imperfections so this thing will get a nice decal put down on top of it. And not have any bubbles or uh, bumps in it or sinkholes. Other than the ones that are supposed to be there for the, for the, uh, the, the screws and the bolts. We can go either way. Come on this way. So after the cabinets have been prepped, they'll bring them over here. See, this has changed since I was here last. <laughs> this is. This is, wasn't there. Uh, I guess they're putting the, the stickers on right here. And they're not doing it right now, but it's, it's, a, it's a pretty unique process. They get it nice and wet, and they use a, a, a light detergent to uh, uh, make them adhere evenly. That's okay. I'll just walk them. Gotta wait for them. What's he got here? What are you looking? You like the Iron Man? <laughs> Come on through this way, guys. And here we're simultaneously putting together the cabinets and the play fields, getting all the components mounted, both inside and underneath the cabinets. Or should I say the play fields? Getting the cables installed. Doing all the soldering as it, as it goes by. This is something that's so labor intensive. And in every model, this, this totally changes, 100%. So these uh, people working here have to really be on their toes and learn something new every six months or whatever the, the turnover rate happens to be. 
and they're pretty good at it. And the game gets flipped over and the top side parts get, get attached. Right now we're doing the Walking Dead Pro. And here's some getting getting rather ready to either be put up on legs or put in boxes. This is the final test. These games get electrically checked out. And adjusted and fixed if need be. So they're running properly before they actually go into a game. And on the other side you can see the, the work in progress. And we're going to take you back to the parts department. Actually, let's go through here. This is where the games get boxed up, ready to ship. And the test of play fields finally get married to the cabinets right around here. And everything gets checked out, top and bottom. I was being told they cannot take pictures. These guys can't. You're right. Pardon me, ladies. It's okay. And if something should happen to break, and you know how unlikely that would be on a totally mechanical game, <laughs> we come to the parts department where everything usually comes from. <laughs> and it's it's quite deep, you only see about half of it. If you get a shot through here, you can see how how deep it goes. There's another room back there with more parts. And we'll exit this way. Yeah, you don't want to go up there. <laughs> You're going to give me an aerial shot? <laughs> no, huh? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We got some younger guy to go run up there. <laughs> the 
this is a shipping area. All the parts got to come leave somewhere, and this is where they leave. Cameras, guys. Today's okay. Really? Yep. And that pretty much concludes the tour. Had this been tomorrow, you would have been subject to some sales department promotions in this area. And this is probably the area you can take a picture tomorrow. So you get in under the wire, I guess. <laughs> You're welcome, guys. Thank you. You're welcome.